Welcome to Little Steps Bake Again's in episode one of the DIY OT Tools mini series, The Bottle Cap Board. If you're looking for an extra tool for motor dexterity or fine motor control, start saving those bottle caps. Because with some hot glue and a piece of cardboard, you can create a bottle cap board. To make a bottle cap board, go ahead, take a saw and cut off the rims of those bottle caps. Then grab that hot glue gun, take those rims and adhere it to your cardboard. Add an optional letter or number and then just screw it on. The bottle cap board has a plethora of interventions that can be used for fine motor control, hand dexterity, visual scanning, or even some cognitive components. Outside of simply opening or closing, you can have individuals retrieve the caps from around the room, high shelves, or use that reacher from the floor. Place those bottle caps in a pillowcase with multiple other objects to improve stereognosis. Place those caps in pockets or in a... Hide those caps in pockets or in a container behind the back. And challenge that balance. Put those caps where we have to step to retrieve them, stand on a balance pad, or have one foot up on a stool for a modified single leg stance. Grab multiple caps for in-hand manipulation, and then only use those first few fingers to screw on. By adding letters or numbers, you can mix up the order, have them rearrange, and even better with only one hand. If we struggle with visual scanning, go ahead, put those caps on the impaired side. Put those letters and numbers sideways or upside down. Have them take off and re-screw on into the correct orientation. Add a cognitive component by assigning different words to spell. Create a word search on there, but maybe put those words backwards. Have that individual unscrew the caps and spell them in the correct direction. Really challenge that memory. Take those caps, Flip them upside down along the table. Only allow them to flip one cap at a time, remembering where that letter was in order to spell a word, or go ahead and put those caps in alphabetical order. And those are just a few ideas that you can do with a bottle cap board for motor dexterity, fine motor control, visual scanning, or cognition. So recruit your team to save those bottle caps. If you found this video helpful, please share, like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more DIY OT tools because as occupational therapists, we're all in this together.